Pulls that one foul. Two down, nobody on. And a good eye there. Gonna count one and two. Time asks for at the plate, and she gets it. Two outs, base is empty. She swings and lifts one to deep center field. Green ranges back on him. Goodbye, Cobra! She circles the bases. It's one nothing. She put a really nice swing on that one, and everything was on time, took a direct path to the ball, excellent extension, and just drove it out of here. Nothing better than when the ball jumps off your bat like that. One down. One down one here down. is Austin Meadows. Meadows. The designated hitter. Nothing yeah. like postseason baseball. Meadows. There's a buzz in the air. Every pitch seems bigger. It's truly special. Two on, one out. Drive caught. The second with the throw in, no chance to get back. It's a double play. So they pick up a run on two hits, no errors, and a man left. We play two full, all tied 1 1. Swing and a miss, strike one. She's usually not one, one, one to chase pitches off the plate, but she did there. We'll see if she can tighten up her zone a little bit. Up ball. and in, ball one. One and one. One run across in the frame so far here in game four of the National League Championship Series. She's a fun player to watch taking it bad. She just battles up there. She doesn't take a pitch off at all. Makes it so difficult on the pitchers out there. You can tell they get frustrated with how long it takes to put her away. I got three and that two. one in the dirt, and that's ball three. The right hander no, gives up four. the two out walk. One of the things about that two-out walk, the base runner over at first base is going to have a very yeah, aggressive yeah. secondary lead. So a ball down the line or an end of the gap will produce a two-out RBI, and those are the best. That is if you are the offensive side of it. Good plate appearance there. Able to take the walk. Here's Nick Prado. Traffic on the bases with one already in here in game four. On the ground right side. He steps on the bag. That ends the inning. And they look. It's right up there, huh? Let's go, kid. And first offering is fouled off. They've got a potent lineup. And when you think about teams capable of rallying from this kind of deficit, they're right at the top of the list. Hit in the air, center field. Green under it. And makes the play, and that's out number three. So no runs, no hits, no errors, and no one left. Last. Right here. And at first, and now here is Spencer Steer. That one down the line. That's a base hit. They fired it quickly, so it's first and second with only one away. And now the first baseman, Addie Wixson. She's already homered in this game. Line drive. Big city shot. She put a really good swing on that pitch. Two outs, nobody on. 
Addie Wexler. The next cup to hit. She's already homered here in this one. And the pitch is in for a strike. He's going wrong. Some hitters are just more confident. They can track that first pitch out of the hand of the pitcher. They don't care if they fall behind 0-1. Time ask for at the plate. Maybe an attempt to break up the rhythm that he's got going on the mound right now. The Cubbies down to their final strike. Two outs. And that's off the inside edge. And the count one and two. down nobody on that one not close the count now two and two on the ground dives and he can't hang on he doesn't have a throw and so they end up with some speed on it first one out away from this game being over but an infield single keeps them alive they're still breathing and maybe this provides that last minute spark Brett. Two outs, runner at first. Brett Beatty, the next cup to hit. Left-hand batter waits. Smash to the left side. Throw to first is in time, and that'll do it. The Marlins take a big three games to one lead here in the series.